Hi there and welcome to this uh, video of the Floss Marketing School where I will talk about uh, keyboard uh, shortcuts. So keyboard shortcuts is a general concept uh, that you can find in all the free software that I know because it's very useful and it's uh, uh, mostly asked by the community. So um, what, what does it consist in? It consists of accessing quickly uh, to the different features of a given software. Uh, so to say, let's manage, I, I just started GIMP here and I just want to create a new image. Then instead of going over here in file and create and click on a uh, new image, as you can see, there's a keyboard shortcut, which is a uh, CTRL N. So as a result, if I'm over here and I just press CTRL N, I will get exactly the same function as if I was uh, over here and as I was clicking on a new image. And this is very convenient in uh, graphic editing software because you need uh, to make um, you, you need a lot of features in a very short period of time. So that's why if you look at uh, the way someone who is experienced about game, for example, is using it, you will see that uh, she or he uh, will hardly ever go over here in order to use the different feature, but they will mainly use, in fact, uh, keyboard shortcuts in order uh, to, um, let's say, to act directly on the, on the design. So let's imagine, for example, that I would like to color this given uh, background in black. I just need to press uh, mesh B and then uh, it's going to automatically fill the uh, background with the color of the, the foreground in my case. If I would like to act, for example, on the, on the layer uh, panel that you can see here on the right, just need to press CTRL and as you can see, just uh, select it out. So um, that's uh, what I wanted to show you about keyboard shortcuts. So um, in fact, how do you learn them? Uh, you don't learn them by art. In fact, it's just about the main feature that you are used uh, to use on a day to day basis. Then uh, at some point you will ask yourself, OK, how can I make this action quicker because I'm fed up of going over here and, and zooming? How could I access uh, uh, quickly to it? And at some point, you just over your mouse on it. And then you will want to try uh, the possibility uh, to use the shortcut, which in my case is Zeta, uh, just to let you know that um, most of the time when you use one of those shortcuts, uh, you get this uh, its reverse feature by pressing Control. Uh, CTR, so that's why actually I can unzoom like this, I can zoom like this, and if I press control, I can zoom. Um, and that's it. Um, just to let you know as well that um, it's going to stick to your head the more that you use them. Um, and as well, that uh, you will see that the keyboard shortcut may be different from one software to another. So, for example, that's the case over here in. Uh, in Inkscape, I'm just going to close down the Inkscape and just going to uh, switch it on back, okay, like this. Um, so, for example, here in Inkscape, um, what I'm mostly frustrated is that sometimes for some shortcuts, for example, you see this one, if you want to uh, add some text, so it's F8, and then uh, once I clicked on F8, I can, in fact, start to design what I uh, what I want over here, so letter, uh, whereas actually on GIMP, it's um, it's the um, it's uppercase T. So if at some point you get frustrated and uh, you would like uh, to to change all of this, uh, just to let you know that you can uh, change those. Uh, so you just need to click over here. I think it's in Edit and then in Preferences, and then within the Preferences you can set uh, your own keyboard shortcuts. And like this, uh, you can feel more comfortable when you move from one graphic software to another one. And just to let you know that it's basic to any uh, other software. So for example, if you take uh, here OBS, uh, on OBS, if you click on for the settings, you will see that over here, you have as well the possibility to um, create your own uh, shortcuts. And that's uh, everything that I wanted to show you today. It's just about uh, keyboard shortcuts, uh, the fact that they exist uh, on all uh, graphic editing software and that the more you know about them, then the quickest uh, you will be in order to uh, end up uh, your different project. And that's everything that I wanted to show you. Thanks for watching.